San Diego County is seeing the biggest spike in COVID cases since early February with nearly 1300 new cases today. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Carlo Chiquetto and I'm Jesse Pagan. County health officials are pleading with San Diegans to get vaccinated if they can. News 8's Kirsten Holmes talked with doctors and health experts who say they're ramping up the effort to get the shot in people's arms. I'm here at the county administration building where doctors tell us over the last month, more than 6,500 San Diegans have tested positive for the virus. This a little more than a month after the state of California fully reopened. County health officials say of the 6,572 cases in the last month, 89% of those people were not vaccinated. If we still had the county tiered system, a spike like this would put San Diego in the most restrictive purple tier. Doctors we talked to say not only are more people catching the virus, there are also more people having to go to the hospital for COVID and more patients are being admitted to the ICU. The good news here is that County Supervisor Jim Desmond tells News 8 that our hospital numbers for COVID cases are nowhere near capacity, but he says the goal is to keep it that way. Listen to what he and a local doctor have to say. So we have a very, very extremely contagious variant. We have a lot of people not masking and we have about 30% of the county plus everybody under the age of 12 um, who are still not fully vaccinated. And that's a bad combination. I'm hoping that we do not go back into lockdowns. I do not want to start wearing a mask again. And, and uh, I think people are, are, are pretty much over it, but you know, we still need a little bit more of an effort to, to get more people vaccinated. Nearly 150,000 San Diegans are only partially vaccinated and officials say doctors are reaching out to those people to get them fully vaccinated because they say that is the only way to keep the spike down. They're also opening eight more free vaccination sites to make sure everyone has an opportunity to get vaccinated. Kirsten Holmes, News 8.